Hi guys, my name is Bihu. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Our weekly post two to three videos related to all. In today's video, I'm going to explain how to write writing task one. Right. So we are going to write map. Firstly, I'm going to read the question statement, and here it is. The two maps below show a road access to a city hospital in 2007 in 2010. Okay, so this is for this map is for 2007 and this is for 2010. As you can see, there are lots of changes made. In 2007, there are three bus stops on the other side of hospital road, but in 2010. These were no longer present in 2010, right? And instead of this, we see the addition of a station on the west side of Hospital Road, right? And uh, in 2007, you can see that uh, staff and visitors, staff and public, I mean, used the same car park. Which is, situation, which is situated to the east of the hospital road, right? And in 2007 and 2000, sorry, in 2010, this original car park had become designed area for staff car parking. And here, a new car park located on the east side of Wing Road. This is provided for public. So these are the main changes that has been done in 2010. So now I'm going to explain the structure of map. First, we have to write. First, we have to write introduction. In introduction, we have to paraphrase the quotient statement. We, ha we are going to write the uh, paraphrased statement in introduction and in overview state how many changes were made. We have to state the changes that were made and summarize what type of changes they were and we have to summarize the type of changes. For example, there are main changes they have done in 2010. For example, in parking, bus stops, and roundabouts. Then after that, we have to write body paragraph one, in which we have to describe the changes to infrastructure for bus access, including roundabouts. Okay. And then after that, we have to write body paragraph two, in which we have to explain the changes to parking areas. Okay. So first, we are going to write introduction, then overview. Then after that, body paragraph 1 and at last we have to write body paragraph 2. So now we are going back and uh, I'm going to explain how to write introduction. Introduction is very easy because in introduction we just have to paraphrase our question. And the question says the two map below show road access to a city hospital in these two years. Now here in sample answer I wrote that the map illustrate some changes that were made to city hospital transport infrastructure between the years 2007 and 2010. I just rephrased the question statement. I just rephrased it okay now we are going to do overview now I'm going to explain how to write overview in overview we have to define three changes that were made to car parking roundabouts and uh, and uh, here bus station okay so here I'm going to read body paragraph one looking at the changes in main detail in more detail we can see that in 2007 there were three bus stops on either side of hospital as you can see in 2007 there are two 
there are three bus stops on the other side of hospital road right and uh, On either side, that were not present, no longer present in 2010. And here you can see that in 2010, these three bus stops are no longer present. No longer present, right? So here I wrote these were no longer present in 2010. And instead of this, we see the addition of bus station. Instead of these, we saw that there they have designed bus station, a new bus station on the west side of hospital road on the west side of hospital road this is west side right this is west side this is east side okay then after that this bus station is assessed via two new roundabouts now this new bus station is can be assessed from these two roundabouts these new two roundabouts right Now the first roundabout is at the intersection of City Hostel and and Hostel Road. This this one, this first roundabout is at the intersection of City Road. This is at the intersection of City Road, right? This is City Road and um, and Hospital Road, right? Then while the second is at the end of hospital road and this second roundabout is at the end of hospital road. Okay. At the junction of with the hospital ring road. Okay. Now we are going to do a writing. Sorry. We are going to do body paragraph 2 we're going to write okay in body paragraph 2 the two maps show also show that changes were made to public and staff parking as i already told you that there are two main changes were made first to buses and here to car parking and uh, in body paragraph 2 we explain the changes to car parking okay and uh, here I have wrote the two map also showed that changes were made to public parking and staff parking in 2007 staff park staff and visitor used the same car park as you can see in 2007 public and staff use the same car park right they are using same car parking and which is situation to the east of hospital road this car parking is located to the east of hospital road right and assessed via a ring road this car parking is also assessed by a ring road as you can see you can assess this via ring road okay then however by 2010 by 2010 this original car parking this origin this is original right this original car parking had become a designed area. This has become designed area. For whom? For staff parking only. Okay. And um, a new car park, a new car park here it is new. A new car park located on the east side of Ring Road. In 2010 they made a new public public car parking right which is located on the east side of ring road and uh, this provide parking only for public only to public like it's a new car parking located on the east side of ring road providing provided parking for members of public so this is our explanation of map and it's a sample answer which is of nine band so in this way you can write uh, our writing task one and uh, 
so guys this is the end of the video if you like this video don't forget to subscribe my channel